is the mother preamp pedal and science amplification. It's my new guitar and bass amp solution, and I'm absolutely smitten with this little black box. Let's talk about it. First things first, if you guys are new here, thank you so much for stopping by to hang out with me today. If you're returning, I genuinely appreciate it. If you haven't already, do the YouTube stuff. Uh, subscribe, like the video, share the video, turn on the notification bell. The Mother is a two-channel preamp pedal based off of the Mother Mark III amp made by Science. Both the preamp and the amp itself are based off of vintage high watts. The science really just uses that as kind of a platform, and it builds on it from there, really turning it into its own thing. Now, this isn't a deep dive into the history of the mother amp or preamp, uh, but if you want to know more, Mark Johnston did a secret weapons video uh, on his channel, and he goes further into this than I really thought was possible. Since starting this channel, I've kind of always been on the search for an amp solution. I live in a really small apartment, I have neighbors on either side of me, and I just can't use a big amp and cab. I can't even really use a small amp and cab. When I first started making videos, my first handful of videos were made using an orange micro terror into a two notes uh, captor. I eventually moved on from that. I picked up one of the TC Electronic Ampworks DC30 models, uh, which I'll link up here. I did a video on that, but basically it was their kind of Amp in a box uh, AC30 solution. And honestly, I really liked that solely for its simplicity. Next, I jumped over to the Two Notes Opus. Uh, I really liked that platform. It wasn't perfect by any means, um, but I thought it was pretty good. Then I tried going all digital for a little while and just running all of my pedals straight into my interface, nothing in between, and just, you know, using plugins in my DAW. Uh, and that wasn't terrible, but there's a lot of the kind of virtual suites that didn't really respond well to physical pedals. And most recently, I tried out the Tone X1 uh, from IK Multimedia. I did a video on that last week. I'll link it up here as well if you want to go check that out. Um, I didn't hate it, but it wasn't for me. Now, while each of these kind of amp solutions did have things I liked and disliked, I think functionally, the one I liked the best was the TC Electronic Ampworks. The sounds on the Ampworks DC30 were fine. It did have a normal channel and a top boost channel that you could kind of blend and mix, and I really like that in an AC30. A lot of other kind of AC30 emulators, be it virtual or like pedal platform, they just don't have that. But I really loved having kind of a single amp in a box that I could run straight into my interface and kind of go from there. And while I was enamored uh, kind of by some of the nearly endless uh, options that a lot of these other platforms had, I do prefer the consistency of a particular amp. Not only do I spend a lot less time tone chasing, but it's also easier to get to know a static piece of gear. So when the mother preamp from Science dropped, I absolutely fell in love. I love the kind of original idea, the platform that it's based on, those vintage high watts. And likewise, I loved everything I've ever seen or heard from the actual mother amp. While the amp seemed like a bit of a pipe dream, the preamp seemed absolutely perfect. In the opening track, I went for something a little different than I normally do. I used different pedals than I normally reach for, and I kind of tried to create something that was a little left of center for me. All of the guitar and bass tracks were recorded using the free Science IRs, and you can pick those up over on Science's website. For the next set of sounds, I'm going to try to come up with four fairly different sounds, all using just the mother itself. No additional effects. First, we'll go for something pretty clean, almost kind of pedal platformy. Think those early high watts. Think kind of a fendery kind of thing. You know, just just very flat. Then something a little chimey, a little more driven. Then we'll switch over to the second channel uh, to push it a little more and get something a little more distorted before we finally kind of crank some knobs and see if we can get some fuzz tones from this. Again, I'm using the free Science IRs. I've used these IRs in the past, and one of the things I like a lot about them is just like the preamp pedal itself, it's just pretty straightforward. You don't have 
a billion different options. So let's go ahead and get into these sounds. the mother preamp pedal from Science Amplification. You guys are going to be hearing this a lot moving forward. Uh, this is going to be my go-to amp solution, both for guitar and bass. I'm super impressed with this. I was so, so excited to get it in. Um, I couldn't believe I was able to track one down. They're really hard to get. And honestly, it's one of those pieces of gear that getting it in and plugging into it and starting to play it kind of made me want to reshoot every single video I've made prior to this. That's it, guys. Listen, you're going to be hearing a lot more from the uh, Science Mother preamp pedal. Uh, I hope everyone has a super awesome week. Later.